Okay, what I'm showing here is how this build and lane centering works. We've got a nice hard white line on the screen and on the street. So the car is very nicely centering itself in the lane and following the lane very closely. It, it does a good job when there's a nice white line on the right side. I'll try to show an example uh, without the white line. Okay, here we've got a two lane road with no markings, no center line and no white line. <clears throat> and you can see how the car is weaving to try to find center line. It, it doesn't come close to the car, but if you were behind me, you would not think I was um, sober. So it's, it's just weaving to find its center line point. Now, as we approach up here, there now is a white line designating these parking spaces. And it's showing on the screen and, it, and it's centered up a lot better. I think it can find the center line of the road, but it has trouble deciding where the right side is. Like right here, we're over into the parking section and now it came and is in the center of the road and now it's going back over to the right. And now we're driving into the parking section and the car came to a stop and I disengaged uh, because it just got a little confused. We're re-engaged on a, on a two-lane road with no center line markings and parked cars on the right side. And uh, center line management of the road is, is what I'm trying to demonstrate here. Car almost ran a red light. Okay, here's another scenario with good lane markings and their lane markings are also showing on the screen. The car is nice and centered in the lane, even with parked cars on the side. It's not trying to use that lane over to the right because the white line is uh, there and visible. Okay, here we've got a nice good left center line, but no right white line. And it continually wants to center in the road all the way to the curb while avoiding parked cars. So it's, it's center line logic needs a little bit more left biasing towards the center line. So here we are, no parked cars, and it's in the center of the lane all the way to the curb. Um, and as parked cars come and go, it creates a weaving sort of emotion. And here comes a white line designation, and it, it does a good job. back into the center bias. Yeah, and honestly, the previous build uh, had a little bit too tight of a center line bias, in my opinion. Uh, so they've obviously changed a little bit of logic here in, in uh, Beta 5.